Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of an Aussie Fummy in the Philippines. Morning, I. Well, what a nice day. A little bit of rain last night, but not too bad. So, <laughs> really? Well, how's all that stuff on the um, the news at the moment? Like, you know me, I don't talk politics on the farm because whatever people do has got fuck all to do with me. If I say I'm right wing, they'll say I'm left wing. <laughs> left wing's right wing, right wing's left wing. You're fucking wings. But I noticed, I noticed on the um, the Canadian weightlifter. Have you seen that? If not, have a Google of the Canadian weightlifter who broke all the records. Now this guy, he, I tell you, I like this story. He is the head uh, powerlift trainer for Canada um, Olympic team or fucking whatever team, and has been for like ten years. And he trains the women's team. And uh, this, this power build, you know, fucking big, like doing push-ups on steroids. And he teaches, he trains the female um, weightlifters. Has been for many years, as I said. So anyway, a bit of controversy that the uh, person, I say person, who's holding the record now for many, many years, many, many years, has won something like eight out of the last nine events, is a transgender. Now, there's nothing wrong with transgenders, mind you. There's nothing wrong at all, you know. We all go down down the pub and have a beer together. How I sit, you sit, it's just a little bit different. But this transgender um, is, is body of a male, of course. It was went through puberty as a male, but um, turned into the um, female, into the female team because she says she is a female now. And uh, she broke, she ha held all the records, um, the, the world records for powerlift for women in Canada. They had been for many years. So the, the coach wasn't um, too, too fussed with this because he's been training all his skills who are natural women, right, with um, natural body parts, who, of course, can't lift as strong as what he, she can, the transgender. So he's gone into it all and had a look through the rules. And the rules state that um, anyone who says that they are um, transgender to a sex will never, ever be talked about, will never, ever question it. So he says... This is wrong. All these females have been training for years and yet this guy comes in, or this transgender comes in and uh, takes all the world records because she says she, he is now she. He said it's not fair, it's not right and it shouldn't happen. Same as the Olympic Committee is saying, if you go through puberty as a sex of a boy, then you cannot join the Olympics female teams. And I totally agree with that. So anyway, what this, um, what this coach has done, he, he's got a full beard and big muscly bars. I have a Google of him. Fucking hilarious. So he... He, he uh, signs up and he says, I'm a woman. I consider myself a woman and uh, I'm going to do the power weight. So he did, so he'd done the big branch press and uh, he broke the record by something like 100 pounds. And um, the girl, he, she girl before was like, that's not fair, that's not fair, you're a man. No, I am a female. Mm, I am a female. So he broke all the records. How good is that? Just to prove the point. You know, and now this other transgender who had the records is really pissed off. Well, I don't know, you know. It reminds me, reminds me of the doctor at that time in the surgery, in, in the doctor's clinic, and the doctor said, Sir, you have a bad rash. And the person said, Sir, I am a female. You address me as Madam, thank you. He goes, oh, sorry, Madam. He goes, Madam, you have a bad rash on your balls. <laughs> Get fucked! <laughs>
There's no issues with anyone. So yesterday was a quiet day. What I did yesterday was um, packed up all the stuff up the back here and I've done some repairs to the wall. Remember that wall bob in between the turkey house and the, and the uh, goat house where the goat had been eaten through the wall? Well, I've, we got that repaired yesterday. And bending down to get through the doors, I said to she, I'm pulling all this fucking off. This is bullshit, it's not fucking going through this shit. Killed me last time when, when she had the uh, babies being born and I went in. So, I'll replace that wall over there, the big hole, as you can see over here. It's all repaired up. I've taken all the, the bamboos off of here that used to go across here. So now we don't have to bend down so far. So I said to Chick, try it out for a couple of days. And if you need, I can cut this off here. And I can just run some timber across the side here. That's no problem, I can do that. But give it a test for a couple of days first. This one here was exactly the same. So I took all the bamboo off of here. Because bending down was fucking killing me. Absolutely. You know, absolutely. But not to worry. But overall, guys... The build from Bob. Thank you very much, Bob, the builder. It's come up very, very well. Chicks is happy as hell. Well, she's even thinking about giving me sex the other night. Well, it's the fort that counts, isn't it, eh? You know? So, they're all going good. Black bitch is happy. Gay stud boy. The reason I call him gay stud boy, because he's another one of these identifies as a fucking female, you know? Is him. And um, he likes to have play tow trucks with the other boy goats so he is another one of those transsexuals so i don't know if he's gonna if i'm gonna call him um was it, was it Ad, adam made, uh, god made adam and eve not adam and steve sort of like mm, okay all right so chicken we're gonna head into town this morning it's payday today pension day you fucking beauty yeah that pisses off the trolls knowing that william gets a pension from australia it's always, oh, you can't, you can't get a pension from Australia if you're not living in Australia. Well, who says that you have to have a brain to talk because you don't have a fucking brain? So it's pension day today, and tomorrow is Easter. So it's strange having Easter because in the Middle East, there's no such thing, you know, it's Easter. And um, I've travelled, as you know, when I left the Defence Force, I went as um, fire manager at Broome International Airport. Then I left there and went to Riyadh in Saudi Arabia. From Saudi Arabia to Oman, it's all year, one year contracts. One year contract in um, Oman, I loved Oman, would have stayed there forever. <laughs> then back to Australia, Hamilton Island. And then Thailand, working down in Malaysia. Thailand, Malaysia, Thailand for a couple of years. Then Qatar for many number of years. Then from Qatar to the UAE for two years, then from the UAE back to the farm, then from the farm to Vietnam for 14 months and then retired back to the farm again. So all those countries, and we don't have Easter. You know what I mean? There's no such thing. You know, I don't know, I don't know when the last time I've seen a fucking Easter egg. You know, it might have been when I, before I left Australia in, um, when was that, 2000, 2005, 2006? <laughs> Uh, 2006 or 2007 when I left Australia. So I haven't seen an Easter egg, I tell you. I've never even here, in this religious country here, it's not Easter. They call it some other fucking thing. Weird shit, man. Weird shit. Well, sir. Yes, sir. You have a bad rash on your balls. Okay, guys, I'm going to say ta-da. I've got a lot to do because we want to head into town. I said nothing's open tomorrow. Been um, Good Friday for us. They call it something else. And uh, all the shops are going to be closed. So we've got to get, go into town, get the shopping done, get the beer supply up for the weekend. And then work out what I can do on building this. So today's going to be fucked because we're going to town. So if I can get everything ready I need on this today, then tomorrow morning I can hit that at 6 o'clock. I can hit that one. And I want it high enough so that everything can go under and I can still mow underneath. So it'll just be two poles. It won't be too bad. That's what she wants. That's what she gets. Guys, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Don't forget, share it if you like it. No fucking problems at all. But please subscribe. I know our, our subscribers went up last month. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. So don't just watch the video. Hit the fucking subscribe button. All right. Bye-bye, I. Bye-bye. Ta-ta. Ta-ta. See you later, guys. Ta-ta.